This is a demonstration showing how one can use Visio to create a configuration file to be used with topology to SROM2 to generate the SROM images of the files. First you need to start Visio and create a new drop. We are going to use a stencil containing the shapes representing Toffee devices. The first step in your design process is to place the device as part of the topology. Second step is to specify unique identifiers for each of the components. The first step in the design process is to specify all DX connections using the connector tool. We have just connected port 1 of the switch to an uplink card plugged into slot 1 of the expansion box. Now we connected adapter 1 to port 3 of the switch and adapter 2 to port 5 of the switch. The last remaining step is to specify the assignment of the slots on the expansion box to each of the adapters. We do this by right clicking on the expansion box and selecting data, shape data. Since we already used slot 1 for an uplink card, we cannot assign it. Here we assign SWOT 2 to adapter 1 and SWOT 3 to adapter 2. We leave the remaining SWOT assignments blank, meaning that these SWOTs are not used. We are ready and we can save our configuration. Remember to use the XML drawing format. This is your newly created configuration file and you can use it with the tool. And you can see the tool properly detects the two adapters, one expansion box and one switch in the topology. It also outputs the request turn pool number check turn pool number and ingress port of each of the connections. The tool has created SROM files for adapter 1, adapter 2 and expansion box 1. You can examine the files and you can later use them for programming. That's it.